YouTube. How's it going? John here at Herman Woodworks. And I did a thing today. I bought a toolbox. Let's get into it. All right. So ultimately, my plan to build a work area, like four by eight sheet type bench, eventually that'll happen. Plans have kind of changed as to the current shop, even though I'm just getting it finished. We're probably going to be moving, possibly, and going to build another shop. So I'm not going to invest a lot into hanging on the walls and stuff here. So for the time being, I wanted to get something for like hammers and all kinds of odds and ends. I can't justify spending the money they want for Milwaukee's or stuff like that. Don't get me wrong. They look awesome. They're nice. But guess what? Boom. Harbor Freight. My first time going there. And I'm stoked to kind of check this thing out. Basically 300 bucks if you got a coupon. It was like 339 what their price was. Let's check it out. All right. So like I said, this is the Harbor Freight Yukon 46-inch 9-drawer mobile workbench. Comes with a little solid worktop. Nothing crazy fancy. Let's open it up. Just in case stuff's damaged, I'm gonna go ahead and save all this stuff. For the time being. Just in case it got banged up or dented in shipping. Oh yeah, wow, okay. It's solid in there. So, I'm gonna have to rip this open, I guess. Staples. All right, let's get the blade. Maybe we won't be taking it back. Ah, it's backwards. So we're gonna have to put the wheels on it, that's for sure. Alright, let me get this turned around. Alright, so there we have it. Get the bag off here. She's a pretty girl, I think. Keys. So you lock it. Instruction manual probably for putting the wheels on. I'm sure the wheels are in one of the drawers here. Oh, we gotta unlock it. I already need the keys. for the side all right so got that bag off there handle like I said for the sides got the hardware in this red bag other box here got the wheels they roll got a brake and 
got all the hardware put those on yeah all right let's get it installed all right so two of the wheels are fixed two of the wheels are swivel ones you're going to put the swivel ones on the same side as the handle um So I'll probably put my handle on this side. They're already tapped and got the nut in there. So literally it's just gonna be screwing those on and I'm sure it's the same thing on the bottom. So I'm gonna get this tipped up on its side and get all these, get all of them bolted on. All right, so I got it up on its side. Take up one of the pieces of foam they have for packing it. Throw it on the ground. That way when you tip it up like this, you don't scratch it up and just like I was saying it's already built in so it's not like you're reaching through a drawer trying to put a nut in on the other side literally just screw the bolts in and tighten them up and you're done handles on let's get it finished All right, so all finished up, got the wheels on. Floats around good. I'm happy. I gotta sweep my floor, that's what half that all that noise is. Um, I think they actually give you an extra bolt for once. Or there's an issue that I haven't found yet, but no, I checked, There's all the bolts are in. They give you an extra bolt and the little wrench for it, but Put that in one of the drawers. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some mats in this thing and actually get my hammers and some of the odds and end tools put away. But uh, yeah, just wanted to do a quick little video on this. So far, super impressed with it. Um, yeah, I, I like it. I will, uh, I'm sure I'll comment later in one of my other videos on how it goes after I get everything and see how it lays out. But uh, this will definitely be, I like the height comes right up right at my hip here you know I'll probably sit my my smaller little drill press or possibly even possibly even like the 13 inch planer maybe sit this on top of here for when I'm doing stuff so excited for to see what project I can get done on this but um, as always thanks again YouTube if you guys are new please subscribe and I will talk to everyone again soon all right, YouTube, realized once I started putting the video together for this that I really didn't show much about what this toolbox can actually hold. Kind of wanted to go over what you can all get fit in this thing, how I got it laid out for right now, get, give everybody an idea. And guess what? Best thing about having a toolbox is all those stickers you get from stuff. You get to start putting on stuff. So... Concept 13, got to show them some love up in Canada. My buddy Mason hooked me up with these awesome stickers and a shirt. I'll have to get that on one of these videos. But if you guys like watching anything motorcycle related or just odds and end mechanic stuff, just about to anything, picking, stuff like that, give him a check out on YouTube. Mason, love the stickers. They're awesome. Time to get those on this thing. But back to this toolbox. So the top drawer, masks, glasses, all the PPE, saws, my measuring devices. The saws will probably come out of here eventually, get those hung on the wall. We'll go down this left side. You got chisels, <clears throat> brushes, scrapers. Gotta get some more wrenches in here. I know I got them around here somewhere. Got a some of my bits, some of my hole augers. Down here at the bottom, a lot more bits, all kinds of my drills, my impacts. One of my impacts is out. Up here, 
Got all kinds of scissors, cutters, staplers. Got all my hammers. Hammer for every situation. My wood burner, some epoxy uh, pigment. Got to start doing some stuff with that. And then uh, circular saw and my reciprocating saw. So, yeah, you can fit a lot of stuff in this. Super pump. So, I've been rocking this thing here for maybe about a week or two now. Super impressed with it. You know, I kind of got it tucked away in the corner here, but I love that I can just unlock this wheel, pull this thing out. Like I said, maybe put the planer on it or the drill press. But, yeah, so far, so good. Loving it. All right, YouTube, that really does it for this video now. If you guys got any questions on this toolbox, hit me up. Like I said, um, now it's actually been a week or two. I've been working with it, loading it up. Really impressed. It's found a little home right over here for right now. I still like that I can move it around. But, uh, yeah, super pumped with it, guys. Everything, the glides on it all work really nice. Yeah, but like I said, if you guys have any questions, hit me up. If you guys are new, please subscribe, and I'll talk to everyone again soon.